In this training module, you'll be taken through the operation of an Amfleet cab car. During this brief introduction, we will go through the critical driving controls and passenger operations. When you're ready, climb aboard. Take a seat in the engineer's position. The reverser sets the direction of travel and activates many of the train systems. Let others know this locomotive is in operation by setting the headlights. The brake mode handle sets the mode of the brakes on the train. It features three different modes, trail, out, and lead. As you are operating the leading vehicle of the train, set the brake mode to lead. To begin loading passengers, you'll need to open the doors. It is time to depart. Close the passenger doors. For this introduction, you will be completing a full lap of the circuit and performing passenger operations once you arrive at the next stop. This train is now ready to go. Release the brakes and apply some power to get moving. Coasting is a method used to efficiently maintain speed and reduce motor stress and maintenance requirements. A control car, or cab car, is a non-powered rail vehicle that allows the engineer to operate the locomotive in the formation remotely. They are frequently used on diesel and electric hauled services, removing the need for the locomotive to run around the train and allowing for push-pull operations. Built by the Bud Company for Amtrak in the 1970s, the Amfleet cars were built to operate passenger services on the Northeast Corridor and to eventually replace the Metro Liners, which also ran the line. Originally, the Amfleet cars were designed as electric multiple units, but are now train line equipped, allowing them to be operated from either the cab car or the locomotive. The body of the cars are made from stainless steel, which gives them their iconic appearance. They can reach speeds of up to 125 miles per hour.
We are now approaching the station. Apply a small amount of brake force to come to a gentle stop. Nice work. Now that the train is stopped, we can open the passenger doors. Good work. That concludes all the basics of operating this train.